Welcome back. Our very good friend of the show, the Unipiper, is asking for your help and helping you get out and explore your neighborhood. So of course we have the Unipiper, AKA Brian Kidd here. We have to show that amazingly epic footage that we <laughs> shot for the open of tonight with Cassie. So thanks again for doing that it with us. It was a pretty epic time. We always love hanging out with you, yeah. but this time we gotta start with something that we do not love because yes, was this yesterday that this happened? It happened on Tuesday. On Tuesday, brand new shirts. They look like really cool shirts were stolen off of your front porch? Right off my front porch. What? Yeah, so we have the security footage. Thank goodness you were recording this. So yep. if anyone, can you really see the person's face? Could someone recognize whoever I, did this? I mean, between their face and their physique and probably their unique style, um, I think they're pretty identifiable. Yeah, and they even used they, they, your very own. It wasn't recycle. my garbage can. <laughs> So somebody else out there is missing Jeez. a garbage can. Yeah. Ugh. People are so mean. So this is a delivery of brand new shirts that look, that match your wonderful cape there. That's right. PDX carpet shirts, 100 shirts. Mm -hmm. So who knows what they're doing with them, but they better not be selling them because they're the first ones that would exist, right? Right, and like I said, I have a hard enough time selling these myself, so <laughs> if somebody else wants to try, be my guest. <laughs> Maybe they'll just like drop off the box next week and they're like, well, we couldn't sell them. No, please return them. Yes, I am really hoping they're found because if, if we find these shirts, I've got something really fun planned <gasps> to do with them. Oh, yes. So even more incentive, Portland, get out there, you know, explore your neighborhood and look for Unipiper shirts. Yeah, seriously, they look like cool shirts, so um, go find them so that the Unipiper can actually sell them and we can all wear them and be really cool and match your wonderful cape. So the other thing you were doing yesterday, yes. you had some good things happening too. You were riding yes. around the square right outside, of, right outside of our other KGW studio delivering the inaugural neighborhood edition of the Portland Visitors Map. That's right. Clearly you are very trustworthy when it comes to knowing about Portland and knowing the neighborhoods. Yes, uh, so much so that they even decided <laughs> to put the Unipiper on the map yes! now. Yes! Um, and so for, you know, for a number of years they've been making this Portland visitors map, but it's only been downtown. Oh. So now, because there's so much cool stuff happening outside of downtown, we've got this lovely version of the map that includes all the neighborhoods, uh, you know, Division, Belmont, Alberta, Mississippi, 23rd, you know, it's just really cool. And there's all sorts of little tidbits about trivia and Portland history on there. Oh. So even for our longtime Portland residents, they'll probably learn a thing or two by picking up a copy of this map. And this is just free for people so free, to pick up? Yeah. yeah. Uh, all around town, wherever, you know, uh, there may be tourist activities and hotels, but you can definitely stop by Pioneer Square and go into the Travel Portland office and pick yourself up a copy. Now, if people will actually somehow find out anything, spot any information about your missing t-shirts, where should, what should they do? Should they, like... Send you an Instagram message. What should, how should yeah, they whatever find you? is your preferred method of uh, social media communication these days. You can find me on Instagram, Facebook, the Twitter. At the Unipiper. At the right? Unipiper. Awesome. Well, thank you so much. Congrats on being solidified <laughs> in Portland's history on the Portland inaugural neighborhood map. That is so cool. Thank you. We can all just hope to be a tiny bit as cool as you and your adorable <laughs> daughter Scarlett someday. And find those t shirts, everybody. If you're watching and you stole them, please get them back. We'll bring it back. <laughs>